Hey guys, welcome back to Hardcore Primer, where we love us so much. Brown boxes again. Yes, brown boxes again, and I have a new unboxing video for you from a company that, like I told you, I love, which is uh, Shozy Toys or Shozy Store. Um, and we have a new box from them, so we're gonna find out what's in this box right now. I'm pretty excited. Typically. Uh, you saw my other video I had that was uh, with um, uh, the unboxing of the Warhammer. So let's find out what we have here. I'm pretty excited. I am pretty excited. Yes. So, before we go any further, make sure, kids, you ask your parents if it's okay for you to use sharp objects to open up boxes. Is it okay for me to use a sharp object to open up a box? Yeah, you haven't, you haven't stabbed yourself yet. Not yet. Not today, people. Not today. So here we are. Like I told you on the last one, man, they come in just like this. Very, very nice. So we're going to go back here because this looks a little bit easier to open. And they tape it up, man. They tape it up really, really good. So we're going to go to... Make a little love to the knife. There you go. Cut it down the middle. Just a little bit. Don't cry about it. Just accept it. And then you come on the other side. Give it a nice little stab. Like in a horror movie. Take it out. Make sure you put it up so you don't lose it like I did in the last video. And almost set on it later on. That's why she's like, yeah, stab yourself today with it. So here we go. We're going to pop that side open. And then we're going to pop this side open, and pop this open, and pop this open. And then, it's also wrapped up And what my kitty is waiting for, the bubble wrap. The bubble wrap. So here you have, I mean, right off the bat, great quality. They care about their customers. They want to make sure that um, your stuff is protected. And so, yes. I highly recommend you checking out their store and look at their product. And the pricing is just phenomenal. So, we're going to wrap the bubble wrap. And we're going to pull out. Oh, my goodness. I got this for my beautiful wife. Here you go. I'm going to let you have it down there on the floor. There you go. You got to take it on the floor. He did call, catch it in the air. It's something I got for my wife. <clears throat> oh, that's so cool. And this is... I like the... Uh, yeah. I like the box art. Yeah. And this is Optimus Primal. Or, you know... Caesar. <laughs> Caesar. Exactly. No, we're not... No. It, give that back to you. <laughs> oh, my gosh. He, he grabbed it twice. He grabbed it out of the air. Oh, oh my uh, three <laughs> times! He took it from me! <laughs> it's right here. We're going to do So, oh, that's good. He he does, but yeah, let him, it there, it worked. So there we go, we have it. So we're going to let them, him play with that over there. So we're going to open this up. There is a, like a barcode thing on the back. Um, not for children under six years. Choking hazards, small parts, ages 12 and up. So you have that. Um, oh, oh, wow. Mm. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah. So, first thing that popped up, or popped out, I should say, which we're going to show off is in a little bag. Because I'm definitely going to put it back in the little bag. Um, is, if you remember, where they got the mutant faces. So, we're going to try something new today. We're going to take a box. Bring that in. Let it zoom. In on, if I can find the... There it is. So, no, it wants to be, it just wants to be difficult. Hmm. So, I'm using another camera right now. So, we're going to try and get this thing to zoom in. Look at the face. Look at the face. Not my hand. All right, it zooms in right there. So, a little bit more. Take myself out of the picture. What's it zooming on my thumb? It's weird. It is weird. I don't know what's up with this camera, but yeah, you do have the little mutated face right there. 
I wonder. It's like Wonder Bread. I don't know. I guess it might be like my, my fingers are so big. So try to use this cardboard so that you can see. So the camera will focus. Because the camera does not. It wants to yes. focus on my hand. Huh. But not there. That's a little bit better. Better, but not the greatest. But hopefully I'll get this all worked out with the camera. But there you go. Um, but nice little face. A little hollow in the back. I guess you could slide over his face. So let's take a look. Okay, shall we? Shall we? Yes, we shall. Yes, we shall. Take a look. All right, so I'm going to put this where the cat won't find it. So now we're going to take him out of his shell. And I'm going to do this delicately. Because you got little pieces in here. So, um... I don't see instructions, so we're just going to show this off. I do really like the the skull right there. That looks really cool. Um, so, and then the little piece comes apart. So, there's that. But I want to do this as an unboxing. Uh, you do get these nice, nice swords. That he has. He has two of them. So we have that. And we have these little teeny tiny pieces, which probably is like little different face bottoms. Yeah. That's what they are. And they're tiny. Mm. Real, real tiny. Oh, wow. And so that will go on the bottom jaw. Of uh, Optimus Primal. Let's take him out. Oh, he looks cool. Oh, he looks really, really good. Um, <clears throat> very I like little... the coloring. Oh, I do too. So. What? They went black, but that's okay with me. Yeah, he's not cartoon accurate, but um, for the price, for around $20, I mm -hmm. couldn't say no to it. Um, I was. Uh, Billy the Kid, uh, no bullshit reviews, is the one that uh, told me about the company, uh, told me about this figure here. So the arms can go all the way out, like so, and down. Legs can kick up, like so, and way, way back. Um, you get some nice split on there. You got some, looks like some die cast back here for the joints. Of the knee, the knee has this nice knee bend going up, like so. Hands, which is cool, which I thought was really cool. When I saw hands will open up, thumb, he'll give you, like he's hitchhiking, you know. Kids don't hitchhike, but sometimes you could in the past. And then you have the fingers that will then fold out, like so. Uh, with that, uh, that will give it where you just put the sword in his hand, like so, close that all the way in around it, and there's that, and that's a nice little, that's nicely uh, snug in there, very, very nice, um, yeah. So I will probably be doing another review where I do a uh, the transformation of him. But you have a nice waist rotation there. Nicely done. Um, figure looks great. I'll have to look up the instructions since there's not any in it. And I, the, the Very, very delicate right here. Little side pieces right there. Those are kind of delicate, but you can be careful. But head turns around, looks up, down, all that good stuff. Um... Keep your arms nice metallic paint all the way around. I like the joints. Then you have the feet. Um, we have like a where it turns. Feet can close up a little bit like so. Or fold up like so. Um, this looks, yeah, very, very nice. And you don't have hollow points. So, yeah, this is. 
yeah this is really cool really really cool i have to say looks really good so there you go yeah check out um check out their store honestly check them out look them up i'll have a link down below uh for their store uh probably a link to the actual figure itself and we've never got a figure we didn't like no like i was saying it's always been really nice uh the figures are well put together nothing seems to be too tight nothing seems to be too loose no they stand up <laughs> yes and and the fact that you have you know the 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 care the care of them being shipped to you you know that it is really people that uh, love the hobby and want to make sure that a product gets in your hands safe and secure so there you have it guys as always like my grandpa said hold on to something for you you'll never go oh look to the stars grab one for yourself bye guys bye guys